Hello, my name is Beverly. Welcome to my channel, Miles and Coffee. I've got a good one for you today, so grab your favorite brew. This video will be a little longer than um, my usual, so let's go ahead and get started. And we'll begin with some general tips for women. This is about travel for women. You want to pack multi-purpose clothing for comfort on and off the flight. Remember, think comfort. Think interchangeable pieces that can be used one to one with another okay you also want to keep in mind this is travel tips for women tip number two consider using a crossbody bag or a backpack purse now the purpose here is for safety not for fashion I'm particularly drawn to backpack purses due to the anti-theft compartments that are included so you might want to keep that in mind another item that I am very partial to is the money bag or money belt that are that conceal your cash they are RFID protected so that your passport and credit cards will stay safe and you can conceal them under your clothes or wear them over your clothes if you choose to. Tip number three, have photos of your important documents such as your important phone numbers that you want to be able to access from anywhere in the cloud. Uh, you know, your credit cards, that, should, that information should be stored where you can access it anywhere. And of course, photos of your passport, IDs, anything that you, if lost, you want access to should be saved in the cloud. Okay, also pin your hotel and your location and share that with your family so that if anything happens, they will know where you are or where your last location was. Tip number five, be sure to have chargers, adapters, and cords. And depending on which country or continent you travel to, you may need a universal adapter. Tip number six, guard your passport. If possible, keep it in the hotel safe. Um, also, you need to know where your nearest U.S. Embassy is and travel with the physical and digital copies of your passport. Never leave your passport in an unintended bag. Let's talk about things you want to do before you go. These are some tips. Number seven, download the offline maps of your destination before you even leave home. You can do this and have them so that your travel is easier. Tip number eight, research that climate of your destination before you leave. Also, will you need an international driver's license? Some of you may want to rent a car or drive. Um, you need to know about the driving requirements and regulations before you leave your own country if you're traveling abroad. Um, number 10, notify your bank that you will be traveling abroad. The bank will ask you how long you'll be gone and where you're going so that they can keep you safe. Okay, now travel etiquette. Here are some tips. Please be careful with oversized baggage. I have done um, a video about that and you might want to check the link below because that is going to be a problem potentially, especially going abroad. Also, remember that the plane cabin is 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 not really a lounge room so let's be mindful and respectful of others space it's all about showing courtesy it's okay to recline within reason but again respect other people's space my next tip there are 
dozens of ways that you can make the airport lines go faster. Do all of what you can ahead of time. For example, having your passport and your ID and your ticket on a lanyard on your neck will save you time. Um, and also, that's another reason for that crossbody bag or backpack purse, which will keep you hands free so that you can matriculate through the lines much faster. Now let's talk about your language, knowing a little bit of basic language. Knowing basic common phrases will help you in the long run. Google Translate is there to help you, but it should not be your main crutch, okay? Also, um, here's a tip. Don't assume that the hotels and the restaurants um, are begging for your patronage. You might find that they are very, very busy. So again, kindness goes a long way in the restaurants and also in the airport as well. Keep that in mind that everyone's trying to get to where they're going when there are delays um, and there are flight changes. Just keep in mind to be helpful. For some reason, U.S. Uh, people from the U.S. and Americans get a really bad rap when it comes to international travel. So keep in mind that we want to be thoughtful and kind in every situation as much as possible. Also, in this day and age, nobody drives you to the airport anymore. That's There's an app for that. So if you can secure Uber and Didi, and when you do, always verify the make and model of the car when it arrives, check the plate. Um, and the driver should know your name if he's the one that responded to your call within the app. So that will also keep you safe as well. What tips would you like to share? Remember, this is related to travel for women. I would really appreciate it and you might help someone else. So please leave a comment below and also don't forget to hit the like button. I really appreciate it and be safe when you are traveling abroad. Okay, until next time on Miles and Coffee. Thank you for joining me. There are links in the description um, for some of the items that were in this video. I'm an uh, Amazon affiliate and if you choose to use those links, Miles and Coffee will get a small um, commission at no additional cost to you. Thank you.